right, I'll be as quick as I can, as quick as it takes to kill somebody, I guess. You want me to be that quick. But, you know, as uh, Ms. Fletcher pointed out, and it doesn't take much to look on the local news every night and see how many black kids, black boys, black men are being killed with these stand-your-ground defenses that these people raise, then they get off. So I take issue with that. I'm the only person here of color, okay? I am a mother, too. And I have a son. And I care as much for my son as y'all care for y'alls. But my son doesn't walk the same path as yours does. So this debate deserves more time. I'm in Pine Bluff. We have killings regularly down there. Mr. Hunter knows he's our prosecutor. Now, I don't know where the heck, I know where you are from, Gary. And I don't know really where Mr. Ballinger is from. But I can tell you that for a long time since I've been back here in Arkansas, I have feared for my son's life. Now, he's 27, he's out of Arkansas. And I thank God he is when you're bringing up crap like this. It offends me. And then to limit the debate, too? This is crazy. You don't have to worry about your children, Will. I worry about my son. And I worry about other little black boys and girls. And people coming into my neighborhood, into my city, saying they got open carry rights, walking down in front of my doggone office in front of the courthouse. That's a bully. Do I have a right to stand my ground with some crazy-ass person walking around with a doggone gun? I don't know what the hell he intends to do. But I know I am scared. I feel threatened. Just like some of y'all walking around here up in the legislature with these damn guns. That, what's his name? Garner came in here walking around here with a damn gun in his, under his coat. You can see the damn print. Senator, you need to stop. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, I don't. What the hell are you going to do? Shoot me? Senator. Senator, shit. Who the hell? I'm telling you, this deserves more attention. You want to come up here with all these little uh, NRA bills and bills that Alec have and all that stuff. I'm talking about my son's life. And I'm talking about the lives of other black kids. Do what the hell you want to do. Go ahead, but you can't silence me. You got your damn silence gun out in the damn chamber today. But you are not going to silence me. With this bill, I think, at least for me, and where, because of who I am, what I look like, I would feel threatened by anybody coming around, especially you, Senator Ballinger. You are threatening to me and to my family. And I, I can't you imagine you. Well, well, let me finish. It's not your time. But obviously, you're from a part of the state where you don't see people of color so much. And some of the things that, the, the behaviors that I have, the expressions that I make, the way I express myself, probably would make you feel threatened. But it wasn't intended that way. And people from different cultures, particularly black people, the people that I grow up around and I live around, that live around me, they feel threatened by a person like you walking into their community, just like that man down there in Zimmerman, in Florida, felt about Travion. Walking in his daddy's community, but that guy had never seen him. And he's gonna demand what he's doing. Well, I 
I'm not going to take the time when you come down there to Pine Bluff to tell me that. But you can be assured that I'll have my doggone gun there. And I'll feel threatened. And I wonder whether I will be justified with a stand your ground defense. Because walking around with guns on your hip and under your coat, and you can see the imprint, it's threatening. You don't know the circumstances that people have gone through. We got killings down there in Jefferson County all the time. And people feel threatened. And I don't know where you come from with all this. Is your community so bad that you, are you planning to come down to Jefferson County with this crap? And if you do, we're going to have a response. And we're going to invoke this stand your ground defense if this thing passes.